Hey Valley Middle School, welcome to your last math video. Uh, before we get, look at tonight's targets, let's go ahead and take a look at the uh, trivia question today. What is the longest book in the world? This is a question that one of the students asked and said I should use as a trivia question, so thank you, L. Uh, officially tonight, our target is uh, lesson 9.9AB. I can reflect on my year and I can share some of my summer plans. Let's do this thing. Tonight, I would like you to reflect on these things. Something you've accomplished this year that you're proud of. Uh, a favorite day or memory from this year in your life. It could be from in school or out of school. Maybe it's a, an accomplishment um, in sports or uh, in a hobby. Uh, and something you want to do over the summer. Now, there's two forms you can use for this. First of all, attached to this assignment, there is a PDF of this sheet right here in front of you. I ask if you do this, that you just uh, take and write these things out here for you, answer these three questions, and maybe put a selfie of yourself up here. Uh, the second way is to just make a short video of it. Uh, and if you make a short video, you can still upload a video to this assignment as well. And then on the last day of school, I'd like to share these things. I think it'll be a fun way for us to end uh, our school year together. So I hope you'll do this for me. Um, all right, moving on to the ticket to the show. Oh, wait. Did I say how much I appreciate all of the work that you've done? I've had a great year. Uh, I love working with kids. I know that one of these days I'm going to have to retire, but one of the reasons why I keep working past retirement date, I could have retired about three years ago, is because I enjoy the kid contact so much. You guys, your energy keeps me going. Um, you're the reason why I get up in the morning. So thank you for that. Um, also, thank you for all the hard work, all the assignments. Being a math teacher in sixth grade, uh, we have the job of kind of making you accountable for the first time. Daily math assignments, getting you to do that. And I'm proud of the work that you've done, and I hope you've seen the growth, not just in math, but also in terms of your academic profile, how you've gotten more organized and you've gotten used to checking your homework and doing things. I'm really proud of all of you, and I thank each of you for that. Uh, all right. Finally, take it to the show. Uh, if there's something you want to share with me, I would just ask that after you upload your poster or your video, you do a second upload. You might want to tell me something that you liked or something that you think I should change um, or suggest in something I haven't done that I could do to be a better teacher. All right? I absolutely won't share those things, the second upload, but the first upload I will. And if for some reason you get those uploads mixed up, you just let me know and we will figure it out the day of. Uh, before we share. All right. Thank you so much. Uh, all right. Here's the, t the answer to the trivia question. The longest book in the world. Uh, it's actually 2,450 pages long and it's impossible to read. Uh, this is the t uh, look at what the bell is. Or, <laughs> sorry, the bell just rang. This is a look at the book. Uh, you can see why it's impossible to read. It's actually a comic book created by this guy, um, a Japanese author. And um, each book weighs 37 and a half pounds. It's 31 inches long. And they made about 50 copies of it. It says that somewhere. And they sold for uh, about $1,800 a copy. So, all right. Thanks a lot for listening. Thanks for being you. Enjoy your summer. Thanks for working hard. Will the following students please come to the office?